Hello community! Today, November 22, 2023, our startup Inflection AI announced a new AI, Inflection 2, the next step up. So, what do we know about this? Now, you know Inflection. Inflection is a startup founded in March of this year. It achieved about 200 million here, first investment round. And then it partnered here with Nvidia and Microsoft and got about an investment of 1.3 billion US dollars. And they built here Inflection 1 as their first model within months. And today, given here the OpenAI weekend of confusion, they are announcing their Inflection 2 model. So what is now specific here on Inflection 2? Why we should take care about this? Now, Company itself claims Inflection 2, the best model in the world for its compute class and the second most capable large language model in the world today after GPT-4. So they claim to be second. They claim to outperform Meta, Microsoft, Google and everybody else. What is interesting, we only have currently their benchmark data. So only the marketing material. And if you look here at figure one, you see here the dark is inflection two, the dark green. And you see on different tests here, the dark green outperforms here the old inflection one model and the palm two model by Google. Now, since Mustafa Suleiman is here, the CEO of this startup company and was the co-founder of Google DeepMind, the R&D of Google, it is no wonder that we have now a very, very excellent infrastructure. And as they tell us, hey, we as a startup, we have this NVIDIA corporation. Inflection 2 was trained on 5000 NVIDIA H100 GPUs. So these are the latest and the best and the most beautiful and the most expensive data center GPUs in the world. Everybody else is going with an a100 and now we have an H100. And to secure 5,000 of them, and it was trained on this infrastructure, well, this is an impressive number for the infrastructure. But what about the software? What about the training? What about here this precise training that you need to get here to a Jet GPT 4 performance? Well, and they say, yeah, we know. We did not release here our Inflection 2 right now because we are currently in the process here of reinforcement learning, human feedback. We have to make this Inflection 2 AI start to behave nicely. And you will not get it here as a model itself, but as they claim, they will integrate it into their AI system called P. Now, you know that P is currently, if we go there, is currently here powered here by inflection one, but you see, this is here P. It can brainstorm ideas, keep a journal, learn something new, read a story, summarize, start talking to P, okay? And here you have P. So you can simply ask, hey, Tell me about Inflection 2. And Inflection 1 is thinking and tells you, hey, Inflection 2 is an AI, an LLM, designed to outperform here Google Palm Lodge 2 and Meta's Llama, trained on 5000 H100. But is it enough if you have secured here the latest infrastructure? Powerful accelerator processors, impressive, can generate more accurate and nuanced responses than its competitors. It's really great to see inflation AI make progress in this area. Well, that's not really a lot of. So let's ask for the technical details of the inflection to LLM. And as you can see, they'll only tell us here about the 5000 NVIDIA H100 GPUs. Yeah, beautiful. So there's a not, not a lot of here. So let's have a look here at the benchmark figures. Yes, 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 beautiful. Now, what are the results? They tell, hey, we have important benchmark to report and inflection to performance on a wide range of benchmark compared yes, to Llama 2, to Grok, 
one by Twitter, the Palm 2, the Claw 2, and GPT-4, and yes, yes, yes. And here you have the performance. All results are five shot without chain of thought for Claw, which only reports value with chain of thought reasoning. So beautiful. So you have here inflection 2 with close to 80 and GPT-4 with 86.4. Great, this is a marketing material, so I would not read too much into this. And if you want to read the inflection one technical memo, beautiful. Other side of benchmarks, yes, yes, yes. Marketing material is beautiful, but unless we see it ourselves, it is not so great. And to tell us, hey, for code, for coding and mathematical reasoning, although not explicit in the focus of the training of inflection to it performs also well. Okay. Now, interesting is that they claim that they're already training now and they have now access to 22,000 H100 NVIDIA data center GPUs. And they say, our speciality will be those big models. We will go here in the next six months to a new model, maybe in Flagstone 3, that is 10 times bigger in the scale. And then six months after that, so maybe in Flexion 4, we will jump another time for another 10 times bigger LLM. So what you see here, that contrary to, let's say, Microsoft that tries to come up with this V2, the smaller, smaller large language model, this startup company is here definitely trying here to be a competitor to the OpenAI model of huge chat GPT-4 or, or GPT-5 upcoming models. They go here for the ground, for the huge model. So therefore, it is interesting if there will be a market for these extreme models. But it is much too early to tell you. It is much too early to have here any results that we can validate. We only have here this Let's call it a marketing. Hello, here I am from Inflection AI, the new startup with some extraordinary infrastructure. And imagine if you have access to 22,000 brand new H100 NVIDIA GPUs, the sky's the limit. It only depends how intelligently you pre-train it, how beautiful you, you fine-tune this system, and then if you use your reinforcement learning to optimize the behavior of the system, to be nice, to be charming, to not talk about any elections, something, or not spread this misinformation, this will be the real challenging. But we have here a startup that goes for the huge, for the ultra huge LLM system in the future. They have the compute infrastructure. So now it will be amazing to see what models they will build and if they can outperform OpenAI in the next six months.